I'm really sorry. We'll have a small break. Jacqueline, can you sing something for us, please? I totally... Please forgive me. Let's listen to Jacqueline with this beautiful angelic voice. Well, before, um, before I sing, Father, I'd like to say a few words, if I may. You may. You, may you. You may, may you. To our beloved father, brother, friend, teacher, and bishop, His Grace Marmari Emmanuel. We are lifting you up in prayers and surrounding you with love and support during this rough time. May the power of God's love and grace bring you comfort, healing, and strength. We trust in His divine plan and have faith that He will see you through any trial. We pray for your swift recovery and complete healing. We pray for continued faith and trust in God's goodness. We pray that God grant you wisdom and reassurance. Fill your heart with peace, joy, and comfort, knowing we and the heavenly orders are all here for you. Do not despair, dear Father, for we are certain God has taken your anguish into account and will not go in vain. For the name of the Lord is to be glorified and known to many. Your sorrows are a huge blessing as your crown in heaven is being filled with more and more precious and divine gems. And we believe that the Lord has taken these sorrows and is using them to warm up the cold distant souls out there in the wilderness to return to Him. We know for sure that the Holy Spirit has chosen you to be the vessel and preach the word of God and speak the truth that has already changed so many lives all over the world. So you see, Father, you are meant to be standing where you are now, and this entrusted mission is not yet complete, as God is not done with you yet. We wish and pray for your well-being, and to always be in good health and spirit, to stay strong, dear Father, we need your spiritual guidance, nurture, and love, for you are our shepherd here on earth, whom the Lord Jesus Christ himself has chosen and appointed for us, the flock. And we, your children, were waiting for you, for your return patiently. May God continue to bless, protect, and watch over you and keep you under his mantle, safe and comfortable with love, hope, faith, and prayers for myself and the faithful community. As for me personally, allow me to say these few verses I picked from a beautiful poem, and I present them to you from the bottom of my heart, as it says. For every time you speak out and say the words I need to hear, and every time you reach out, I can feel God's love so near, Every time you listen to me because you know I need a friend and every time you stop what you're doing and help me find my way again, you are the hand upon my shoulder when I'm hurting. You are the voice of truth and love when I'm searching. For every time you reach to help me in my need, one day Jesus will say, you did it for me. So I hope you know, to me you are the hands of God. Love you, Dad. God bless you for us and forever, always.